Yo, what's up guys? Today we are at, what we're gonna do today, we're gonna go inside, we're gonna pick out some soft plastics and I'm gonna take them and compare them to mine. We got Norman Yak Pack with us today. They're gonna help us pick them out and we're gonna go inside. We made it to the fishing section guys and the first thing that I see are these yum dingers right here. So I'm definitely gonna start off with these. I'm not gonna do watermelon because I feel like watermelon will be too easy. We're probably gonna start off with the this color right here. It's like a pumpkin seed type color with red flake in it. So this is gonna be number one. Next we have these KBD Perfect Plastics. So I'm probably gonna pick out a couple colors of these. Let's do a crazy color. Let's do, let's do, I've actually never, yeah, these. I've never tried these color. What is that? Sweet tater pie. Sweet tater pie for the next oh, one. We gotta get the sweet tater pie go. light going. Okay, so we got pumpkin and sweet tater pie. Norm, you wanna get the next one? I guess yeah. next in line is the big bite baits. The okay, trick okay. sticks. No, the fat sticks. That's what they're called. Uh, what about these ones right here? The black neon chartreuse tip. I think those are pretty cool. That'll work. That's different. We'll get them. Yeah, what a color. What a color. <laughs> let's see. Now let's try to pick something out of the zoom section real quick. I'm going to get some of the Magnum Finesse Worms in June Bug. Closest thing that Zoom makes to a uh, stick bait, so we're gonna get it. And for the last thing, you know we gotta go with the Guggen baits. This is gonna be the first time that I fish Guggen baits on this channel, so I'm not sure which ones I wanna get. I have to get a good color though for the first time. I don't have anything black and blue yet, and I don't have anything watermelon, so it's either gonna be the black and blue lumpy logs or the watermelon red lumpy logs. So, just any, any, my move, blah, blah, blah. I like to go fishing, I'll pick this one. Okay, we're gonna go with the watermelon red. It's the last one, so. We got the watermelon red lumpy log. So we got all of our baits and we're gonna go check out and we're gonna get ready to go fish these. So stay tuned. Hello beautiful people. We are in our talking spot in our garage. What we're about to do in the video, we're about to go to the pond and fish the soft plastic lures that we got with Normie at back in Academy and compare them to see which one we can catch fish on fastest. Next, we're gonna compare them to our soft plastics that we make here on the Melting with Larry videos. Melting with Larry. So we're gonna go ahead and get into that. All right guys, so we got our first bait tied on the Lunker Log. We're gonna give it 30 minutes and see how many fish we'll catch on it. Oh God, if I catch a fish on this, I'm gonna be freaking pumped. I just wanna catch one fish. Like the first one, after that first one, it's like. <laughs> Feeling like P. Diddy. Jesus Christ. Tom, what I'm gonna do later is I'm gonna go buy a watermelon and wrap rubber bands around it until it pops. Oh, there we go. Oh my God. I knew there were bass in here. Is that even a bass? Yeah, it is. We got a largemouth bass right here on the lunker log in five minutes, so. As of right now, the Lunker Log is in the lead. All right, guys, fish number one weighs about six, maybe seven pounds on the Lunker Log. Is this camera on? Yeah, on the Lunker Log. We're gonna get him back so he doesn't perish. Whoa, I hope I got that. Yes. Six slow-mo for the video, fish number one, let's go. Hey, Riley, you're so sweet. I just caught a fish, you wanna smell my finger? Oh, guys, we caught a bass in five to six minutes. I'm not really sure. We're just going to say six because the GoPro was on seven minutes. But I looked at my watch and it was 5.15 and now it's 5.20. Or it was 7.15 and now it's 7.20. So, all right, Riley, it's time to pick the next one. Good pick on the Guggen Bakes. Sweet tater pie? No. Scum dingers? Mm, no. Okay. The big bite bait. Oh, gosh, no. What about the Zoom Magnum Finesse Worm? Okay, so it's between the Sweet Tater Pie and the Yum Dinger. Which one is a fan favorite? Okay, that got the most recognition. We're going with the Sweet Tater Pie. Fly me to the moon. Let me. Okay, time check. It's 726. So we're going to see how long it takes us to catch one on the KVD Perfect Plastic. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Yeah, no. I'm fishing in this sweet tater pie lure. It's probably about eight minutes, like actual water time. So we're going to give it a couple more. Really good. It's only on 22%. Oh, what is that? Is that a fish? There's a fish. Oh my gosh. That's actually a decent fish. On the sweet tater pie. 
Okay, we're gonna have to go down here probably. Oh my gosh, that's not a decent fish. I lied. But he is running. That is not a bad fish at all. On the sweet tater pie. Get that. All right, so we got fish number two on the sweet tater pie. I'd say it took us about 10 minutes. So the Guggen baits are still in the lead right now. Oh, so sweet. Maybe National Geographic will see this. Fish number two on the sweet tater pie. Dude, I'm gonna, oh God, that's an ant bed. Oh my God, I'm about to get destroyed. Oh. I think we're good. Two for two on ant beds today, guys. We got big bite baits right here. I don't think I've ever fished with these, to be honest. Should I retie? Yes. Am I going to? No, because I'm just that type of person. Oh, that's a fish. Oh, man. I think he was on there for a while because my thing was just swimming. I will. Did y'all rent those? There we go. That's a fish. Oh, it came off again. Jeez Louise, son. Well, we've caught two fish, so I'm going to say that this is tied with the Guggen bait since we haven't landed one, but it, the bait itself has attracted two fish. So this bait right here so far is tied with the Guggen bait. If we catch one, then we're going to give it the lead. Oh, we just had a little nibble right there. There we go. That was a small fish. Jeez Louise. Now I'm just fishing with this lure just because the fish are loving it, but they're not taking it for whatever reason. Oh God, that's a snake. No, we dipping. No, that was a whole snake. I don't know. I don't look for long enough. All I know is I saw the body and it was slithering and I'm out of there. I'm ready to go to the next spot. Big bite bait, soft plastic. Still tied on, still trying to land a fish on it. We've lost four so far. So hopefully, maybe this will be the spot right here. We got a nice drain over there. So we're gonna cast in that direction. At this point, we're just really fishing with this for fun. Oh, there's a fish. I thought that was one. On the big bite baits. Here we go. Hey, calm down, dude. Literally has a bluegill tail sticking out of his mouth. Like, this is a hungry little sucker. Fish on our big bite baits. Soft plastic. Please swim off. Swim off. You just took off, so that's always good to see. Guys, my GoPro wasn't. Oh, man, that sucks. Huh? And the fish, but I mean, I can tell them about the fish, but guys, I just caught this fish. Dude came over here, tried to kick me out. I'm with Macy. Macy lives in this house. He didn't want to believe it, but he lives right there. Then he basically gave me permission to fish anywhere out here. Um, I'm not sure if he owns out here or whatever, but thank you, kind sir. He wasn't talking, he wasn't too sweet at first. He was real deal ready to kick me out. And then I'm like, I'm with Macy, she lives in this house. And he was like, no, you, these people right here will call the cops and these people right here will call the cops. But little do you know, I'm with these people's family member right here that lives in this house. So sir, I just caught a fish out of your pond. Guys, y'all do not know how bad I wish that that cam uh, camera was on for that whole encounter. Like y'all real deal missed it. These are definitely a lot heavier, but they sink a lot faster. Oh, we just got hit. Oh, there we go. That's a fish. There we go. Oh, that's a good fish. That's a really good fish. And the zoom baits win, guys. And the zoom baits win. That's all she wrote. Oh, my God. That's a really good fish. Mm, freaking Mike Iconelli out here freaking catching these toads. How does this drain? These fish are like real do like stacked right here. Perfect hook set. Top of the mouth. Decent fish. Oh, no. Swim, swim, swim. Swim, please. Please swim. Oh, he's getting his marbles back. You're swimming the wrong way, dude. This is going to be really cool. Don't worry. I got you. Uncle Larry is here to save the day, guys. Once again with another fish rescue. We're going to send you that way. Hey, dude, turn around. The water is... You're really good at this game. He goes. That's how you do it, folks. That's how you freaking catch a fish. Let's freaking go, baby. I think that's going to be my new thing. Every time I catch a fish, I flip the GoPro up and I'm like, all right, guys. So we're going to be responsible this time. 
and we're gonna set a clock, a stopwatch actually. We're gonna go to stopwatch and start. And whenever we catch a fish, we're gonna stop that. And then we're gonna do the same for the Guggen bait. So here we go. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, there we go. There's a fish right there. Let's see what our stopwatch is at. Whenever we land it, there we go. Two minutes, three minutes, right at three minutes. Okay, y'all see that? Three minutes, we got a fish right here and three minute timer. Here we go. There we go, guys. That's on the big bite bait, soft plastic. Now we're gonna test out the Guggen baits to see basically who comes in second now. Wow, see you later. Guys, now we gotta catch one of the Guggen baits in under three minutes. So I have faith in them that they can do it. All right, guys, we're gonna start the timer in three, two, one, and we got three minutes to catch a fish for the Guggen bait to take the cake. All right, guys, we gotta find these fish. Let's see, I'm not sure what, how much time we're at. But we're at, okay, we got like time for two more casts, maybe. 312, okay, so the Zoom stick bait, they came in first, big bite baits in second, Guggen baits in third, Yum Dingers in last, and am I missing one? AVD Perfect Plastics in four, Sweet Tater Pie. That was actually pretty cool that I caught a fish on a Sweet Tater Pie lure. Here's the thing, guys. You know that I make baits personally myself. We have to put our baits up against all the big name baits and see how we do. And I'm gonna just start a stopwatch timer on my phone. guys so you might have noticed that i didn't use the yum dingers in the video so first of all i had two break on me like back to back cats like they just snapped off like they were too hot or something i don't know what happened with those the third one that i tied on my gopro was in hyperlapse mode so basically like it's a time lapse and there's no sound and it was like i caught it reeled it in real quick and threw it back probably took about 15 minutes so i didn't even put that in the video i just said i'll come on here and explain that to y'all it was still in hyperlapse mode when i was using my soft plastics but it just happened i caught the fish in a minute and 27 seconds i'm not gonna lie i kind of cheated i didn't see the fish but normally there's a fish like sits underneath the log that i catch it on so i mean eh, eh. it still caught the fish so that's all that matters so i appreciate y'all watching so much oh lord almost had another fall thank y'all so much it means a lot thank you for the support on the channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you want to see more videos also don't forget to go check out norman yet pack their channels will be linked down below in the description so check them out if you want to see more collabs with them just type in the comments hey collab with norman yet pack again and we will make that happen for sure also if you have any challenge videos you want to see if you want to see me do anything different with my soft plastic lures just let me know We're working on getting the new mold so that's coming soon in the meantime until i talk to y'all again don't forget to fish them hard and have a good day